Hi, everybody. Welcome to Writing for Tuesday. We are going to talk about our animal research. So you need your paper that looks like this and a pencil, okay? You should already have your name at the top and you should have your animal you're researching. I know I heard from Ava yesterday. Ava is going to be doing um, a cat. And I heard from Tinsley and Jack and both of them said they wanted to learn about horses. So I'm excited to see and hear about all your projects. After we get these done, we'll have to do another Zoom where we can um, share what we learned about our animals. Wouldn't that be fun? And we can share all of our research. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is Ms. Thompson is going to show you how to do this. I have my sheet. I'm going to go to my book. Now, how do I get to my book? Remember, um, back on the blog where your parents take you all the time to do your lessons, you go to the resource directions and you go to Pebble Go. The password and username are right here. It says engaged learning. So engaged is the username. Learning is the password. You click. And then we type in engaged and then we type in learning and we can get in. Now, once you get in, you go to animals. And remember, Miss Thompson's going to search for chickens, right? Okay. Yesterday, you should have already read your book. That was the lesson for yesterday. Today, I'm going to read my book again. And this time, I'm going to take notes. Okay. And this is my note taking sheet. So the first thing I need to do is take notes on what does it look like. So let's go to my book and find out. Okay. Chickens are large birds with red combs and wattles. So this is their comb and this is their wattle. And remember Fred, my chicken Fred, Fred already has her comb and wattle coming in. Her feathers can be white, brown, red, or black. Chickens can weigh up to 18 pounds. Okay, so I can write that they have red combs and wattles. So that's what I could write. And I could also write that they have feathers. I got lots of things, so I'm gonna write um, I'm going to write red combs, right? Red comb, combs. And if you can't remember how to spell something, where can you look? Yeah, you're going to have your the book right in front of you. Okay, red combs and let me go back and see. All right, there it says waddles right there. And waddles. So I can remember that they have red combs and wattles. And that's my notes. And I might want to write feathers later too and add, but I'll definitely make a page in my book about how chickens have red combs and wattles. Okay, habitat, where does it live? Okay, let me keep reading. Habitat. Most chickens live on farms. Farmers all over the world raise chickens. Chickens like eggs and nests. Four chickens can take turns sharing one nest. Oh, that's good for me to know. Well, I have in my coop, it has three nesting boxes and I have three chickens. So everybody should have their own nest. But um, some of the books Miss Thompson read about chickens says that they sometimes fight over the beds because they want their favorite bed and the other chicken might have it. So we'll see if mine have any fights over the nests. So... Um, and this is my, this is a chicken coop somebody made. Mine doesn't look like this. This one has wheels, but mine does not have wheels. But it says ch most chickens live on farms, not all chickens, because Miss Thompson doesn't have a farm, but I have chickens. But since most of them live on farms, I'm going to write farms right here. Farms. You think I should also write houses? Or maybe I could write co a coop. Because they have a chicken coop. Coop. Okay. So I've got what they look like. I have where they live. Now what's this one about? What they eat. So let's go see. Food. Next one. Chickens will eat insects. And I have. I've seen my chickens eat bugs. Grain. And even human food. Farmers usually feed chickens grain and water. Chickens peck at food with sharp beaks and that's what mine do so my chickens i've seen them eat bugs i've seen them eat worms they definitely eat grain i give them their chicken feed and um human food okay so i have fed mine apples and cucumbers so far and 
Um, I definitely have to give them water. I have to give them lots of water. So that's what chickens eat. So I can write bugs and grain and they need water. Well, let me go back over here. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna write is bugs. Bugs. I'm gonna write grain. That starts with a blend, G-R. Grain. And then what else? Oh, I said water. So I know they eat those things, right? That's what my book said. Look at all this research I've already done. You guys, you guys are gonna do this in a minute on yours. Um, I didn't say this, but you should not be writing these things because you're not doing chickens. You're just watching Miss Thompson, right? You're just watching me do research. You are doing research on your animal in a minute. You're just watching Miss Thompson practice. Okay, wait, what was my last thing? Something interesting, okay. Let's read about their life cycle. After chickens mate, the female lays an egg. She sits on her egg for 21 days until it hatches. We know that. Some adults in about three months. Chickens live up to 12 years. So my chickens could be 12 years old. We'll have to see how long my chickens live. Okay, fun facts. Chickens cannot fly far. Female chickens lay an egg almost every day. That's cool. And remember, well, they won't have babies in them. If it's just girl chickens, they're just the kind of eggs that we eat. If there's a boy chicken, a daddy chicken, there might be babies. Chickens lay eggs even when they do not mate. See, these chicks do not hatch into chicks. These eggs are for eating. Okay, so, oh, I think that's what I'm going to write. Lay eggs every what? Every day. All right, it's pretty cool. So look at all the research Miss Thompson has. I'm ready to write a book now because I have information for how many pages. I could do four pages and I could do an ending. Okay, so I'm ready to write a book. I can have a book all about chickens and I can tell you all about it. You, boys and girls, my super writers, listen to me. You are about to make your own research page and then you're gonna turn it into a book and we're gonna practice that tomorrow. Today, I want you to go find your animal book on Pebble Go and I want you to read it again. I want you to take your notes for all four of these things. And then tomorrow we'll talk about how to transfer that into a book. And then we're gonna finish our books and we're gonna illustrate them. We're gonna add labels to these books um, and we're gonna make them great. And then we're gonna share them on Zoom together, all of our research, okay? I am very proud of you. I want you to keep being super writers and be super smart. Um, but I can't wait to find out what you learn about all your animals. Okay, bye.